Hello mga kawander ham Ang video natin ngayon ay Learning task 2 ng grade 8 week 8 Tungkol sa proofs pa rin So letter A, B, and C A, B, and C Pero hindi ko sasagutan lahat Sasampo lang ko lang kayo para alam nyo kung paano gagawin sa ibang numbers Disclaimer muna ulit Hindi po teacher si Kuya Wander Pwede po ako magkamali sa aking sagot so, letter A, muna tayo, make conclusion on the following patterns. So, ito may anim na, ano, sa number one. Titingnan mo kung may pattern, kung may pagkakapare-pareho sila. 1 plus 1 equals 2, 1 plus 3 equals 4, yung mga yan. So, ano bang napapansin natin na pare-pareho? So, pare-pareha sila na yung pinag-plus, kung napansin nyo, ay puro add numbers. to add number 2, 1, 3... 3, 5, 5, 7, 15, 17 Add number lahat So pare-pareha sila Tapos yung sagot Yung sum Kung mapapansin din natin Pare-parehas naman na even numbers So ano ang ating uh, Natuklasan O ano yung ating maiko-conclude Conclusion So base sa na-observe natin Maiko-conclude natin na uh, the sum of two odd numbers is an even number. Is an even number. So, yun ang conclusion natin. Pag pinag-plus mo pala ang dalawang odd number, ang magiging sagot niya ay even number so ayan ang ating conclusion sa so, number 2 at sa so number 3 ganun din gawin nyo tingnan nyo lang kung ano bang pag magkakapareho may add number ba na pinag add o even ano yung sagot even ba or add ganun din sa number 3 tingnan nyo kung may pagkakapareho pareho sila tapos dun nyo kukuhanin ang conclusion ok next naman letter B use law of detachment to draw conclusion Ito, hindi ko talaga to alam eh. May mga nag-PM sa akin, sabi ko, hindi ko alam to. Hindi ko masasagot. Pero may nag-send naman ng module, kaya pinag-aralan ko pa. So, sabi sa law of detachment, if P, if P then Q, yung P, R, O, Q, is a true conditional statement, P is true and Q is true. So, ganun daw. Tingnan natin, paano natin isasagot yun dito. Number one, if two lines are parallel, then they do not intersect. So, ano ba yung P? Two lines are parallel. Anong Q? Then, they do not intersect. Ito yung Q. Ngayon, kung true daw to, uh, ito yung isa pang P, lines J and K are parallel. So, two lines are parallel, lines J and K are parallel. etong two lines na J and K parallel daw. So, kung true din daw tong P na to, ibig sabihin yung Q ay true din. So, ang conclusion mo ay conclusion. Ang conclusion mo, kung parallel tong J and K, hindi sila nag intersect So, ang conclusion mo ay lines J and K do not intersect so ganyan po number 2 uh, if there is lightning then it is not safe to play outside so yung P mo there is lightning then ito yung Q mo it is not safe to play outside tapos yung isang P mo Peter so lightning so may nakitang lightning si Peter ibig sabihin hindi safe na maglaro sa labas so yun ang conclusion natin uh, ano ba therefore therefore it is not safe it is not safe to play outside dahil may nakita si Peter na lightning Eh, kapag may lightning, hindi safe. So, hindi safe mag-play sa labas. Pwede rin siguro, therefore, Peter is not safe to play outside. Pwede rin siguro yun. Pero ito na lang yung sagot ko. It's not safe to play outside. 
Again, sagot lang po ito ni Kuya Wonder Makakari pong mali So kayo na pong bahalang mag-analyze Letter C Use law of syllogism to draw conclusion Determine if your conclusion is valid or not Justify your answer So ano? Ang sabi, ang law of syllogism daw ay If P Then Q Tapos and Q then R Are true conditional statements Then P then R is true So, tingnan natin If it continue to rain Then the track and field oval Will become wet and slippery Tapos yung pangalawang statement If the track and field oval will become wet and slippery Then the track and field game will be cancelled So, ito yung P It continue to rain Ito yung P Ito yung P Tapos, then Q. Then the track and field oval will become wet and slippery. Ito yung Q. Yung next statement naman, if the track and field oval will become wet and slippery, so ito yung Q. Kaparehas nito, di ba? Ito yung Q. Then, the track and field game will be cancelled. So ito naman yung R. The track and field game will be cancelled Yun yung R So sabi sa law of syllogism kapag If P, Q Tapos Q, R Pwede mo daw pagdugtungin yung P Tsaka R So magiging P, R Itong, Ito yung P Dudugtong mo dito sa R So Ang conclusion natin Ay Sagot natin Paano ba isusulat yung sagot Hmm Lagi ko na nga lang Hindi, sige, sulit ko na lang If P If it Continue Oh, di nakita Continue to rain Ito yung P natin Then Dudugtong mo sa R Ito yung R Then The truck And Field Game will be cancelled so ganyan po ang ating gagawin sa iba pang mga items uh, shoutout portion na po tayo so asan na ba yung shoutout shoutout sa mga kawanderham natin na sina Lean Factor Zero Slayer 2.0 Jessa Balba Joseph Balita Jemima Guillermo Nickman TV Natalie Jane Busa Lynn Bukoy Maridel Jaurige Alisa Aguilar Chelsea Shane Yon Shoutout sa inyong lahat Salamat sa inyong pagsuporta Sa ating YouTube channel Kung may natutunan kayo Please like, share sa inyong mga classmate, best friend, tropa at crush at pa-subscribe niyo na rin sila sa ating YouTube channel. Bye bye.